But tomorrow yeah. we're going to do a repeat performance. A little cooler at the lakefront because that water temperature is still in the middle 50s. But what a day it was. Our weather watchers finding some beautiful trends of temperatures. High as 82 in Bourbonnais, Rensselaer, Cheryl and Mike 82, Schaumburg 85 from Elton and Gurney. Typically a cool spot, but still you did hit 74 degrees. And right now temperatures are holding straight up at 80 in Bourbonnais from David Sprout. He has lots of sunshine. Look how he spent his day. Ah, in St. Anne on the golf course. How lovely. And you couldn't really blame it on the wind today, David. It was a gorgeous day. 79 degrees was the high officially at O'Hare, above our normal high of 70. The cool spot has been the lakefront. With that wind off the lake, we're holding now at 57 degrees downtown. It's 80, though, in Aurora Joliet, 82 in Ottawa, 78 degrees in Kankakee. So nice and mild around the region. In fact, Twin Cities right now reporting 86 degrees for a current temperature in Des Moines, 82. So High pressure is in control for us, keeping that heavy rain system to the south of us. North of us, there's a front that's stuck. It's stationary because of this blocking ridge of high pressure. So this little rain probably won't even make it to Green Bay. It's just going to fall apart. The hefty storms across the northeast and mid-Atlantic states, well, the severe weather for the moment has turned off from last night, but we still see showers and a few thunderstorms from all of that tropical moisture streaming across the Florida Peninsula, creating storms in Jacksonville and Savannah and Charleston tonight. We have low pressure here, but it is not expected to form into anything tropical. It's too close to land and the water temperatures there are just a little too cool this time of year. But what this will do is pull that humid air up along this boundary and create some heavy rains tomorrow. Now into Friday, the question is on the leading edge of this, would a few sprinkles reach our southern suburbs? There's less than a 20% chance, but the chance does exist that we could see a sprinkle of rain Friday afternoon, but by far the hefty storms stay away from Chicago with that system. So for tonight, it's clear, it's quiet, 56 for the low temperature with light winds. And then during the day tomorrow, we'll do it again, pushing near 80 degrees in some neighborhoods. But with that northeast wind at 10 to 15, I think lakeside temperatures will probably hold closer to about 60. We will see about 82 in DeKalb and 83 degrees in Joliet. So the seven day forecast does bring in that tiny, tiny chance of a stray shower on Friday would be short lived. Not everybody gets one. It's just from that system in the south how far it reaches north. Better rain threat for us overnight Saturday and into Sunday, but a nice trend of temperatures here, Robin Erica, over the next seven days. Definitely more to love than hate. Thank you, Mary Kay.